Hi, Lady Leopards. It's just me, Mrs. Jones. I miss you all so much already. Um, I'm going to try to make a few videos and have them posted um, in as many ways as I can so you guys can still make artwork over this um, little break. So for the first project I thought we could do today was just with some things that you already have at home. So I got some tops of things for tracers. So I have a circle top from a container, another circle top, a bottle top, and I have Benjamin's sippy cup. So for this activity, all you have to do is take these circles and just trace them anywhere on your paper. I'm going to use a Sharpie so you can see, but you can use pencil. So here's one, and you can put them anywhere on your paper. and just hold them down and trace them. They can go off the page. They can go in a row and when you're done, it's gonna look something like this. So just trace them all over. After you trace your different circles, and they don't even have to be circles, then inside I want you to do some designs, do some lines. And since this is, a, this is at home, if you want to do some hearts, you can, or stars. Um, but I like to just use lines and shapes just so it looks really, really cool. So I'm going to start in my fourth and fifth graders and third graders last week. We were talking about complex designs and making them really, really interesting. So let's see what you can come up with at home. So I'm going to start with just this weird wavy line. Okay, and then from this wavy line, I think I'm going to repeat it to kind of make a weird pattern going on. But if I left it like this, it would be a little boring. So now I think I'm going to make some diagonal straight lines in there. And maybe then I'll crisscross them. All right, but I wouldn't want to leave that because then it's still really boring. So in here, maybe I'll do some zigzags. So while you guys are at home, in between your homeschooling packets and all the cool things that you're doing at home, I definitely want you drawing too. And it doesn't have to be anything hard or difficult. I'm going to try to get lots of different um, examples and ideas for you guys, but the point is just for you to be drawing because we know how important it is for our brains to create things. Um, my final product is right here, and it took me about mm, 10 minutes, so not long, so you can just trace anything you have at home, tops, cups, um, and it doesn't even have to be circles, and I use Sharpie markers because that's all I had, but you can use crayons or color pencils. I would love to see what you guys make, so say, take some pictures and try to post them or email them to me. Um, I miss you guys. I'll try to put up something again tomorrow. Um, love you, miss you, make some artwork.